Every year when we create the ULI Poland conference, we try to find topics that will be inspiring and thought-provoking, and this year I think we managed to do exactly that. We had a very interesting discussion about where does Poland sit in Europe today, and it was very interesting to see new technologies that can be applied in the urban footprint, alternative way of moving around in a city and moving around inside a building. In my opinion, currently the biggest challenge that we're facing in the capital markets and real estate sector is bringing the holy triangle of the banks, the investors and the occupiers to align their interests and find exactly the right product for all of these three different groups. Without these three different groups aligned, we will see no deals happening and this is what's holding us back a little bit right now. The main challenge ahead of us right now when it comes to human behavior is how we deal with the so-called poly crisis. The situation in the world right now where we have all these crises on top of each other. What that leads us is into a bad place when it comes to our mental health. If we think about the, the built environment, we also need to think out does this building, does this urban space improve our mental health? And it should be in all of our future plans and future strategies. We talked a lot about ESG. Most of the discussions concentrated on the S, on the social aspect. I personally think it's a very good sign. One of the most important S aspects in the ESG is affordable housing. And I think, I do believe, that both private and public sectors should work jointly together to make the housing affordable. The fate of the Russian invasion of Ukraine, how it will finish and on what terms it will finish will drive the future of Europe. Of course there are other factors at play, so Russia, China and the United States, probably in that order, will determine the future prospects of growth and stability in Europe. I think there was a lot of takeaways. I think it was very well planned. I think all the, uh, the, the different sections was actually quite nicely intertwined. I think also the whole affordable living discussion was very interesting. I think uh, ESG is going to be one of the huge drivers in relation to the institutional world and by that also the real estate industry as, as a whole. I think ULI provides such a unique platform for exchange and for learning new things. People are very enthusiastic, people have lots and lots of ideas. Uh, the room feels absolutely effervescent with energy, so I find this a really, really exciting environment. ULI conferences do always keep very high quality and the content is always very appropriate and up-to-date and relevant for the audience. And I found this year panel discussions interesting, particularly around affordable housing, ESG developments. So I always attend those conferences and I recommend ULI members to attend those.